Folks, this isn't TV. I can see you're not a body. <laughs> I'll balance this thing on my face. <laughs> Once balanced on my face, it will vanish into thin air. It's gone. <laughs> I'm a little tired it's because last night my hair was so perfect I couldn't bring myself to go to bed. <laughs> they tried to confiscate my hair gel at airport security when I was flying out here. I had to let them take it. I just put it in my hair where apparently it's legal. <laughs> Five ounces of hair gel in your bag and they think, oh, you could be a terrorist. Oh, but 20 ounces on your noggin. Well, then welcome aboard. <laughs> I was getting patted down at airport security, and the guy says, when I read sensitive parts of your body, I'll use the back of my hand. <laughs> you talk about disappointments. <laughs> Fellas, if you ever get patted down at airport security, you want to get out of it? Just shout these two words. Female assist. <laughs> You've got to know your rights. Sometimes I'll just say I'm gay and I don't feel comfortable being patted down by another man. It's too arousing. <laughs> but I insist on being patted down by a woman, preferably a leggy blonde in equestrian boots. <laughs> All right. Uh, Mark, can I get some cheesy cocktail music, please? <laughs> oh. I'd like to dedicate this next trick to all of the ladies in the audience. <laughs> and I think you know who you are. <laughs> I know a lot of men try to impress women with their money. Others rely on their charm and good looks. Me? I do odd things with olives and toothpicks. <laughs> You have to work with what you've got. <laughs> right now, I'll share one of these odd things with all of you. So that you two can have more success with the opposite sex. In my case, that's women. <laughs> now, it all began when I saw a beautiful woman with a drink in her hands. I approached her, removed the olive and toothpick, and performed this trick. She told me to get the hell out of her house. Now guys, remember, it's important that you don't appear to be in too big of a hurry to impress her. You say something like, hi, how are you? Now watch what I can do. for the audience. Anybody out there with a the lighter? You just raise your hand. You don't have to come on stage or anything like that. You got one over there? That's fine. Just more to be sure, sir. I should be able to catch it. I am the juggler. Oh! I got it. Thank you. That's a very unusual trick. Anyone out there with a crack pipe? If you can just raise your hand. Do not throw it. I call this the flaming marshmallow balance of death. I will now balance this coat hanger on my face. Once balanced on my face, I'll set fire to this marshmallow, recite a poem, and then extinguish the marshmallow with my mouth, making this the most difficult badge for any Boy Scout to earn. Notice also that I'll be performing this trick with the aid of the special cardboard pant safety roll bar. <laughs> now, if what you've seen me do thus far hasn't exactly been your cup of tea, I assure you that what I'm going to do right now isn't even a beverage. <laughs> 
so yelling directly at me, man. Thank you. I now present to you, for reasons unclear even to me, the flaming marshmallow balance of death. Now the first step is locating the light. <laughs> oh, there it is. No, that's not it. <laughs> this is going to take about 20 minutes. <laughs> now it seems that I'm a harsh fellow for burning a blameless marshmallow. <laughs> Tell me why a thing shouldn't fry if it's destined to end up on Jello. <laughs> you guys know a lot of hotels use these hopeless coat hangers now? Yeah, I steal them anyway just to piss them off. <laughs> I, uh, you know, a lot of you have wondered from time to time why is it people never try to impress their family and friends by juggling plastic grocery sacks? Here's why that is. Drunks in the back are going, even we can do that. <laughs> I wanted to make this a bit more exciting, oh as if that were possible. <laughs> I'll attempt to juggle all three grocery sacks using only one hand <laughs> at a time. <laughs> well, this won't last too long, so don't worry. and I'm also a notary. <laughs>